From the West Coast to Colorado and Oklahoma, this year's wildfire season is already red hot with no state harder hit than bone dry California. And when our engine companies are getting on scene, they're seeing explosive fire growth. After four years of historic drought, Cal Fire has responded to more than 1,100 wildfires so far this year, nearly double that of a typical year. And they're treating each fire like an all out military assault. We launch everything. We're talking ground crews, helicopters, hand crews. Even if it's a little spot, we have to hit it hard. We have to hit it immediately. Look at this summer's above normal fire activity outlook spreading from the West Coast into Nevada, Idaho, Montana, and Wyoming. The fight expected to cost the U.S. Forest Service up to $1.65 billion this year. Put that on. Cal Fire let us suit up on this training mission. Turn it down. A first-hand glimpse at the grueling fight. Move forward. Some firefighters carrying 45 pounds of gear on top of the hot suit. Hold. Surrounded by smoke and flames so hot, you have to turn your face away. How you doing? I'm good. After just a few minutes on the fire line, I was out of breath. How long can someone be doing this? Hours. Hours? Hours. As long as it takes. The firefight this year may also be longer with such little water. You have to go farther to get water now. Absolutely, because in some areas they, their wells are dried up. Our helicopters have to fly further. So all of this is just compounding and compounding. And with little rain expected, there's concern there may not be enough water later this year should a massive wildfire erupt. Brandy at ABC News, Los Angeles.